Hey guys, we are back now with more of Hearthstone, Heroes of Warcraft, The League of Explorers. And we'll be continuing the second week, so let's get ourselves started, shall we? Yeah, last time we tackled the first week, and despite some issues, we did... Yes, that never gets old. Anyway, we're about to begin the second week. And yes, I am commentating this because I thought, why not have some fun with it? Although trying to wait for it's a big pain in the keister. It is. Ah, here we go. Yeah, we've already completed week one, and now it's time for us to begin week two. Oldemar. Now what's up? Hail, fellow explorer. I'm Brown Bronzebeard, the League's founder. I've got a lead on the headpiece of the staff. It's somewhere here in Uldaman. Interesting. And it looks like we have our first trial. Uldaman's infested with trogs. We'll have to fight through them to reach the headpiece. Yeah, our first opponent is Chieftain Scarvash and his hero power, Trog Hate Minions. Enemy minions cost two more. You swap at the start of your turn. It's a passive hero power. Oh, this is not going to end well for us, isn't it? It just isn't. And yes, I'll be using Uther for this. Yeah, I'm hyped for this because, unfortunately, the next wave won't be coming out till I believe, much later. I really don't know for sure. I don't know all the details, but only time will tell. Okay, let's see if we can get this through, and I hope we can get through this without any issues. Because, yeah, even as we speak, my program's not running strong enough. Keeps giving me errors. Let's begin. Uther versus Scarvash! Ultaman for Trogs only! I will fight with honor. For Trogs only, huh? Alright. Let's get this show started. Good hand. Good way to start things off. Oh dear. Scarvash was a wee trog last I was here. Now he's bigger, stupider, and uglier. Trog no stupid. Trog make you stupid. So it changes between monsters and spells, huh? All right. This just makes it all the more interesting. Let's begin. Trog no stupid. Oh, this can not be good. And it's going to be switching every single turn. Reporting for duty. Weapon ready. Alright, we got the first hit. And now they're going to switch things up, which means I'm going to have to play really strategically here. That's a lot of trogs. That is a lot of trogs. These mithril runes contain guardian code. They must date back to the titans. Focus, Bran. Yeah, what she said. Anyway, let's do this. One day, I'll be a real knight. Don't worry, loves. The cavalry's here. Weapon ready. Get out of Yeah, I'm gonna have to strike hard, strike fast. At least my weapons are not affected. Oh dear. Guilt. Deal two damage to a random enemy. That's not a good sign. For justice. Weapon I need to get rid of that. And quick. Well, more trogs. What's with this guy? Oh, now we're gonna have some fun. Now let's see what the Murlocs will deal with us this time. Oh my, this is gonna be good. For justice. Yep. Gotta make sure I get rid of as many minions as possible just to survive. Although with this, this is just gonna make it all the more interesting. Starfire, and my Murloc Knight dies. Come on. Jerks. What jerks? You know what? Fine, I can work with that. Alright, let's see what we get. 
No, we don't win. That sucks. You did your job, my friend. Though I wish it would have stayed on, then we would have had some real fun, like with old Merc guy. That would have been hilarious. Uh, tunnel trot. Um. Oh my god, this is bad. Oh wait, who am I kidding? I can at least do this. Follow the rules, pal. No, it spells it too higher. Fine, I'll just use Mockless Champion. The battle. The battle. The justice. Good. At least by weakening that, it won't be a threat to us. Lightning Bolt, deal three damage to a minion. Oh. What dorks? And why do they keep getting my fort? Well, isn't that dumb? You just made a big mistake with that. And here is why. Alright, good. Now I can really do some damage. Wow, thank you! Thank you. I smash oh, Smash Stupid? I'm on Smash This. Oh, that takes care of him. More tunnel trucks. None may steal us. Well, that's not pretty wise. Considering two, three, eight, nine. No, I don't have enough. Oh wait, I do have enough. Watch. Reporting for duty. Well played. I win. This is my responsibility. Justice shall prevail. The battle. Ha! Such a shame. At least you did put the effort. Minecart? We get a Tunnel Trong and a Thrill Conjurer. This is interesting for mages because it could like discover spells and it could bring like all sorts of nasty possibilities. Okay, so what's next? This mine shaft leads straight to the center of Uldaman. It's the center, huh? Escape the tribes. We have to flee the mine. What's our time limit here? Oh dear. Looks like we're gonna have a deck by default. This should be interesting. Let's do it. Watch out, we're being chased! We have ten t Okay, so what am I supposed to do with spells like this? No. Deal ten damage. Oh, be careful with that stuff. You took out the joke of the track. Hey, relax. Alright. More trucks. I think I'm starting to understand how this works. And they even add repairs. Deal three damage to a random enemy minion. And these guys deal two six damage. Another dynamite and a spike decoy and a keen attack. Ooh, this should be lovely. We only have about eight turns left. Oh, these trogs are persistent! Alright then, let's add this. And... We only have two mana for this? Wait, Wait what? Oh dear. They're piling the pain with this. Hmm, what do I do here? Because I know 2, 4, 6, 10, 16 damage. And I have two of these, so... Deal with the 6-6. Six, six. And deal three damage to all enemy minions. 
No, oh, it'll have to work. And they're packing the pain. We only have five turns left. Oh, goody, got another one. Come on, be lucky. Yes! What? That's a 0-3 debris. Ooh, this'll help. Deal 3 damage. Okay, so once I hit like... Oh, not again. Persisted much? Time to use the repairs. Wait. Indeed. Now we deal three more damage to all enemies. And get rid of this. Man. And with these two, we're done. Barrel forward. And sadly, this game is mine. GG. Nice. Lost them. The head beast is in the next room. And we obtain a tomb spider which lets you discover a beast, as well as the unearthed raptor. Choose a friendly minion and then you gain a copy of its death rattle effect. Useful if you have a lot of death rattle monsters like with the pops. And now comes the last one. Giant Arcadus has got the headpiece, but he won't give it up without a fight. Nope, he won't. His hero power summons a 0-2 stature for both players. This can be most useful, but I'm going to be using Medivh for a little while. It's game time now. I think this second week's not that bad, especially with the mineshaft. Medivh versus Arcadus! Let the games begin. Let the games begin, indeed. Yes, and I love Medivh out of all the characters. I just love Medivh. A servant of the ancient titans. Oh, the stories he could tell us. If you weren't too busy burying you in stone. I couldn't agree more on that. And I think the whole point of this level is that he's going to keep summoning minions every single turn. Get in there and fight, maggot. This can be pretty problematic. Wanted, dead or alive. Nice, he got a crackle. And the more minions he summons, the tougher things get. Oh dear. And he's adding a paladin secret. My guess, competitive spirit. I'm gonna have to strike hard, strike fast. And I may have to destroy my own minions to make sure of that. Yep, yeah, I believe that's the whole point. Fight, oh, come on. Oh, well, thanks. You saved me on a lot. This would help me. And he does a sacred trial and gets rid of my snow chugger. Well, that sucks. Ah, oh, no, it's Direwolf Alpha! And a Shadow Word Pain. Thank you. Wow, you're doing me a big favor. Too bad I'm doing you an injustice. Blizzard! Yeah, I don't wipe him out. 
Oh dear God. Please bring me something sweet. Yeah, let's see you try your luck with this. Oh my! That's nine damage. And that's what I consider to be really dumb. Please give me a flame strike. A flame strike for crying out loud. Well, that did not help me much. Darn it, what do I do? Well, that takes care of his taunt. Whenever a character's healed gain to attack, that will not do us much good. Well, so much for Dr. Poom, and he now brings out another one. I'm screwed. Or not. How many fingers do you see? Good, that wipes him out, but my bigger problem is that. And I'm gonna end up running out of... I will Shattering Spree. For every statue destroyed... Damn! Damn, he got me good. Well, I guess that didn't go so well, didn't it? You know what? Let's use Uther. Although by this point, I don't have much of a choice. Uther versus Arcadus! Who dares the wrath of the Makers? I will fight with honor. Alright, let's see if this is any better. Well, this could work. Muckless Champion could work. But it depends if I'm lucky. The light protects me. I just need to make sure to reach at least by about, say, turn 5 to play it. Then I can start using its Inspire to dish out a lot of damage. The light protects I fight. And he's gonna coin, and he's gonna like do it with taunt, right? Yep. Animate Earthen. Yep, these are gonna give him a fighting chance. Not on my watch. I fight. I fight. No, I'm not gonna summon another minion. I just wanna make sure to start cleaning out minions. And he does another one. Why would you waste two of them, really? Because I can do this and wipe it clean. Sorry. Here comes another. And he brings out a dire wolf alpha. Get in there and fight, maggot. Now to commence the plan. <laughs> I hope. But no matter what, I'm still gonna end up dead. I fight. Gotta do gotta try at least. Another dire wolf alpha? Oh my god. Or he knew. He was smart. Touche. Yeah, but you want to know something? Nice. Here we go. This is where things are going to get really dicey. And when I mean really dicey, I mean a letter on a literal sense. 
Now to start wiping you out a little at a time. I hope. And you're just gonna keep doing damage with Shattering Spree. Why? That was dumb. Because at least now I can start building up more damage. Should have went for the face instead, but instead that cost you big. And you're done. G freaking G. And to prove it, I'm just gonna add Kukrid measure. Bye. Bye. Told me three tries, but I persevered. Man, that was tough. I got lucky there with Muckless Champ. Yep, and we obtained the Fierce Monkey, which is a nice warrior card. As well as the Reliquary Seeker. Ooh, this one would be useful if he had like a whole lot of minions. Then that would at least still like a power up. And let's see what we won. Legendary. We obtained... Ron Bronze Beard, which means your battle cries trigger twice, as well as the excavated evil. And we got class challenges. They found the second piece. My plan is nearly complete. I got a bad feeling about this. No, seriously, looking by the staff that you see there, it's a bad feeling. All right, time to tackle class challenges. We have Druid and Paladin. And we're going to be using Druid one to, to win against Chieftain Scarbash. Alright. This is going to be a lot of fun, I'd say. Malfurion versus Scarbash! for frogs only! I must protect the wild. No, this is going to be useful. Let's start things off nice and swift. More minions? That's fine. I'll summon two 1 1 saplings to start things up. And it's gonna switch between monsters and then spells. I wouldn't be surprised if the heroic one would be even more of a pain in the butt to do. Mm -hmm. Another night on the proud. You gotta start dealing damage. You gotta deal as much damage as possible. No minions yet. Which means now I can just start packing in the pain. Even with weak minions, that will not matter. There you go. Doing fine so far, but I'm not counting myself out yet. And he's got a lightning bolt and does three damage. Wasted! All right, let's try this out. Oh, this will be useful. Both players have spell damage plus two. This is gonna be crazy. A hunter's secret. This could mean one thing. Oh, why did I waste that? Yeah, because I had no minions. That ha yeah, that was my fault. Why did I waste that seven? I don't know. But at least I'm going to summon more minions this way. A rumbling elemental. Whenever you overload game, one attack per lost mana crystal. Alright, let's see what we get. And I think... Hey, let's, let's try this. That's not better at all. No, seriously, that was just dumb. Not that it matters because the game's almost over. Well, he's done if he draws that. 
And either way, he's done too. Although, despite the fact of my little stupidity, yeah, I kind of screwed up on that. Pretty easy challenge, honestly. Pretty easy. And we obtain the Mounted Raptor, which has a death rattle which summons a random one-cost minion. This could be helpful. And now we move on to the second and last one of the class challenges, with a Paladin against Arcades. Let's do it. Uther versus Arcades! Who dares the wrath of the Makers? I will fight. Oh, well, I don't I know. Will. That'd be me. And it's Arcades, not Arcades. I get this mess messed up sometimes. My hand's not doing pretty well. Although this is already gonna give me some ideas. Yep, a lot of ideas. What, no one one in taunt? Oh, such a shame. Fine, let's do it. Pandolins. And the more minions he's gonna let me summon, the more more attack I can unleash. Give your minions one one and taunt. Now he decides to do it. He does it on turn three. Not very wise, my friend. Not very wise. Especially when I can up the ante even further. No, wait. Yeah, let's try that. This gives us now. Okay. At least we got a good start. Seriously, I'm getting it more out of this. Oh dear god, destroy all statues. For each statue destroyed, deal one damage. Well, that sucks. And Solemn Vigil. Well, so much for my offense. No, but I'm just gonna amp up the power even more. Okay, I'm gonna summon another minion and then I can go on the attack. Let's hope so, at least. Slam. Deal two damage to a minion if it survives. Oh, guess not. You really want to do that, right? Not... Very wise. See? I'm not giving you any opportunities. You don't deserve any of them, obviously. Except for that. Hmm. Alright. Let's try this out. Bye! No, oh, wait. Cancel. Alright, let's see you try your luck on me now. Wanted. Dead or alive. Wow, thanks, Bellslinger. I get a swipe. And now my competitive spirit takes over and I wipe you out completely. Nice knowing you! No, 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 no. No, no, I want to BM this. I want to BM this for good measure. Watch this. No, no, watch this. No, no, watch this. This is just too, this is just too hilarious right there. Okay, so we got 6, 16. You know what? Dead. I said dead. And you, sir, are dead anyway. Nothing like BMing for good measure. And I am going to BM you. Bye-bye. That was a pretty easy challenge. With Raid Leader, you basically can now have minions that can fight back. And with it, we obtain the Keeper of Oldemon. Set a minion's attack and health at 3. And it's a very useful one at that. Useful ability. And with that, that concludes the second week of the Lee of Explorers. The next week, unfortunately, they may not happen next week, but it may happen the week after. 
so I will be covering them. As always, thank you guys very much for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit the like button. It really does mean a lot to me, and I really want to see if you guys show your support. And next time, we'll continue with week three. When it'll happen, I'll let you guys know in an update. Alright, peace out, guys.